Hi everybody, this is Gadget Trish, and this is my third attempt of trying the Nutribullet Six Week Transformation Challenge. Now, this is also my final time doing this. This is my third and final time. They said the third time is the charm, so this is my last time attempting this. Um, because I am redoing this for the third time, I will have to make a few changes. Initially, we were supposed to eat in color for seven weeks. Now it's six weeks for me. And unfortunately, it's going to carry over into the new year. But I found a way around it, but we're not going to cross that bridge until we get there. Because right now, we're still struggling with this. So this comes from your Nutribullet Classic or 900 Pro manual recipe user guide, right? Now, if you didn't have this in your package or you have a whole different machine altogether like the Nutribullet RX or the Vitamix or the Ninja, then you can buy the book separate at Amazon.com, Macy's, Bed Bath & Beyond has it in the stores. You know, just do your homework. Even some people are selling theirs on eBay. The whole premise of this whole challenge is to incorporate more raw foods into your diet. You want at least 51% raw food every day in your diet. You also want to have a certain amount of animal products and in each phase you get less animal products, you get less oil, right? So how are you going to make this work? Well, you need protein to build muscle. And I found out through a nutritionalist, thank God that I just so happily bumped into, she's asked me a few questions, you know, what's my eating, how much protein, are you sleeping well, are you drinking enough water? To be honest, no. So. How am I going to get more protein if I, ha I can have less animal products? We're going to use things like chia seeds. Now, chia seeds is good for inflammation. Um, you're also going to have to put two or three servings to really get more protein out of it. But this is a superfood. It makes good. I, my new favorite thing is chia bowls. Now, I'm not going to go crazy with chia bowl bowls during this challenge, but as soon as this challenge is over, I'm probably going to have a chia bowl every freaking weekend. It's my favorite thing to have on Saturday and Sunday. Um, pumpkin seeds, one fourth cup has nine grams of protein. It also helps with um, pesticides, um, parasites in your stomach. So throw it on your salad, throw it on your drinks, but definitely pick up some raw, unsalted pumpkin seeds to benefit for some vegan protein. My go-to also is flax seeds. Now again, you're gonna have to put probably double the servings to get more protein but this has omega-3s um, it's better if you buy them whole though and then you can put it on your salad or grind it up in the drinks Nutribullet is really good at grinding up the uh, flax seeds but that's another way to get protein and my new rock star my favorite new protein is hemp seeds hip, um, hip, um, hemp heart seeds I realize when you use this over the hemp powder you get a better creaminess in your uh, drinks also it has a lot of protein too three tablespoons is 10 grams of protein so you could put this on your salads if you're doing chia bowls put it in your chia bowls good stuff and yes these things are very high in calories but they're good calories, they're good fats, they're gonna help flush all this stuff out, they're gonna build your muscles, they're gonna help your muscles heal, okay? It's a little pricey, but you are worth the investment, right? Instead of you spending money on overpriced coffee or eating out, you're gonna make these purchases mainly in your house. Um, for snacks, I would highly recommend a protein bar. Now I'm using Kind because at the time, I could only, Kind seems to have the lowest amount of sugar. Um, they also have a protein option, so you get 10 grams of proteins in this version. This is five. Both of these have five grams of sugar. My only criticism, even though it has no GMOs, I can't find an organic version. So if anybody can think of a tasty, organic, protein, low sugar bar, please let me know in the comments. And last but not least, I was exercising every day. Um, I was using the Xbox Connect. Some of my favorites is Your Shape, USC Trainer, Dance Central, and Zumba Core is amazing. It's really good for burning your abs. 20 to 30 minutes a day. So 
I have my game plan. I am excited. I already started losing weight. This is now my second day into the challenge and I already lost almost a half a pound. And my calorie intake was high because I was using my fitness pal to track my calories. But it it basically came all out. It was the best. I know this is TMI, but this was the best day I ever went to the bathroom. And when I mean the bathroom, number two, probably in history. So I just think the protein was the missing link. And I am sleeping more. You know, if you guys are having any struggles, start all over. This is your journey. And until my next post, Gadget Trish and my puppy, Gigabyte, who recently got um, neutered, are out.